so good to be here with y'all today. My name is Emily Ann Roberts. We're going to keep the music coming. I got a lot of new music, y'all. I just released a brand new album last Friday. It's called Chickens. Any of y'all got chickens in here today? <laughs> Dress in many colors, all right? 
Um, and so that's a little fun fact about what we got on up here. But um, we're thrilled to be here, and we love Miss Dolly. We thought it'd be fun to do you a Dolly song. During my time on The Voice, I got to sing this song. Mr. Blake Shelton uh, was my coach on The Voice, and he picked this song for me to do on the show. And it's about hard-working folks. I know we've got a room full of them here today.
This next song is real special to me because we got to have two really incredible country music legends on it, on my project. And I think that you would recognize their names, uh, Vince Gill and Ricky Skaggs. Do we have any of their fans here today? They were huge influences of mine, and I was so honored um, and humbled and grateful that they would uh, be on this project. And so this one's called Still Search. Right up here, y'all, and I've already signed it up. 
and we are giving away a set list each show to one lucky person. And all you have to do to enter to win an autographed set list from your show is go in Google on your phone and type in set, S-E-T dot live, L-I-V-E, set dot live. That's all you gotta do, press go. It'll know where you're at. It'll know you're at my show and you just fill it out and we will text you right after the show to let you know if you won. But you can't do it tomorrow. You gotta do it today. So if you wanna do it, go to your Google, do set.live, and we're gonna pick a winner at the end of the show. Um, but a lot of the songwriting inspiration comes from my relationship with my husband. We met in Spanish class in high school, very romantic, I know. Um, and we don't remember a lick of Spanish, y'all, not one bit. But our relationship's going great. We got married uh, just about three years ago, and he is the biggest blessing in my life. I love being his wife, and I love writing songs about him. And I wrote this one back when we were just dating, and I knew he was the one, because forever didn't seem like long enough to love him. And I hope that this one reminds you of your special somebody as well.
It's everywhere. It surrounds you. And that's why I love this place so much. We can't come back home and not do one of my favorite bluegrass songs. Now, we do a little bit of a jacked up version of this. We've got the keys and the drums. So if you're a purist, open up your mind. Okay? It can be exciting. Okay? I know you know this one. Okay? Y'all have some fun with this song. So if you are into bluegrass and gospel music, you will love High Road. you got to check them out. This is Miss Sarah Davison on the keys. Back here on the bass, this is one of my dear friends, Sarah Davison. Um,
this guy is from the great state of Texas originally. And he is absolutely wonderful. We love him so much. He's an incredible drummer, an even better guy. Um, and we love having him out with us. He keeps us laughing on the road. Um, he also has a beautiful wife back at home and a precious new little baby named Lincoln. So we know that it means so much for him to come out with us and leaving uh, his little baby back at home so we don't take that for granted. We love him so much, Mr. Kevin Smith. from Middle Tennessee originally. He's what we call a Nashville unicorn because he's lived there his whole life. And for some years, he decided to be an accountant, y'all, by a phone say. Um, he put music on the back burner and thought that he was going to go get a real job. And now that he has ditched that life, he says he feels like he's retired every day and he gets to do music for a living. We love him so much. He plays that fiddle and he plays guitar so well. He does it all upside down, left-handed, that is. And um, he's just wonderful, Mr. Jordan Larson. Thank you. Very much. And last but not least, on the electric and acoustic guitar, this guy keeps the wheels moving for me. I wouldn't be able to do what I do without him. He has been with me since I got off the voice, so for about seven years now. And um, I'm so thankful to get to work with him and hear his incredible guitar playing every time I get to play live. This is Mr. Tori Harden, everybody. a part of probably means the most to me because it's about the place that raised me up and made me the woman I am today. And that's my little home church here in East Tennessee. Without that place, I would have never met the Lord. And I'd be lost as a ball in high weeds, as they say. Uh, and so I'm so thankful for that. And I hope it takes you back to a special place in your life, too. This one's called The Bend.
Jesus, change now.